Dr. Bree back with your Cairo quick tip of the week. This week I wanted to talk to you about a little bit about your posture. And the big point that I want to make this week is forward head carriage. How many of you are on your phones, tablets, sitting at a computer, driving, um, pretty much everybody. We're all guilty of some form of uh, technology in our lives. And due to that, outside of just our normal human presence of what we do, which is looking forward even when we run um, these technology objects are causing us and even our adolescents and our, our pediatric generation to have severe forward head carriage that's where your ear should lie directly over your shoulder and now everyone's is starting to go severely forward there are a lot of studies being done in the um, pediatric population this is going to cause a lot of uh, not only structural problems with the cervical spine the neck but also neurological issues because of the imbalance, the strain on the soft tissues, the strain on the, the actual structure, the bones, but therefore then the neurology. So we're gonna have a lot of different symptoms that are coming from that. Makes a lot of sense when you look at the science of it. So what you wanna see is your ear directly over your shoulder. Your ear should be over your shoulder, your shoulder should be over your hip, your hip should be over your knees, and your knees over your ankle. It should all be one straight line. Um, so one exercise that you can do that's very simple to integrate into your daily life would be every time you're driving in the car and you're at a red light or a stop sign, you simply push your head back against the headrest. Now, you're just going to push it back. You don't want to look up. You want to push straight back, hold for two slow breaths, and release. Push back, release until you can go. Uh, if you're not in the car, you can simply lace your fingers. Put your hands behind your head as if it's the headrest. Don't push with your hands. Hold that sturdy and push back with your head. You will feel that in the base of your skull. That is strengthening those tiny muscles. It's gonna help pull those ears back over your shoulder and help rectify that forward head carriage. Make sure you teach your kids and I'll see you next week.